Hello, this is Cheo with another Chit Chat. It's uh, with great sadness that I announce the passing of our dear friend and colleague, Melissa Vargas. Melissa was the Director of Operations for the Provost Office and was instrumental in assisting many of our programs and offices within Student Affairs. I want to offer my sincere condolences to her family, friends, and colleagues. We will miss you, Melissa. Career Services is hosting a virtual Zoom workshop today from 2 to 3 p.m. on the topic of job searching during COVID-19. This is a great opportunity for students looking for jobs during this unprecedented time. Please re re RSVP to online career services at unm.edu if you wish to participate. Let me thank Dr. Jenna Crabb and her staff for coordinating these meaningful virtual career events for our students. The UNM Children's Campus recently received approval to serve as a summer food program sponsor, providing free meals to children between the ages of 1 through 18. This program will be set up as a drive-through, grab-and-go, and is open to the community on a first-come, first-served basis. In a previous chit chat, I told you that Dr. Kim Kleppel is retiring from UNM at the end of this month. She has been an instrumental part of our division and the university as a whole. Please read the in-depth story about her career at UNM on our student affairs news page. I'd like to thank her for her tireless dedication to our students and we will miss you, Kim. The Association of Students of UNM, or ASUNM, is currently accepting applications from undergraduate students for a variety of open positions within ASUNM. You can apply for, the follow for many of these positions and get more information at the ASUNM website. And African American Student Services is hosting a series of lectures on their at UNM Afro Instagram page entitled Shaking the Room. The series started last week and continues every Wednesday at 4 p.m. through the month of June. I encourage you to tune into this important series. And this is another reminder that UNM Johnson Center and Seidler Natatorium will not open for several more weeks due to construction and also the university's response to COVID-19. We are excited though for the return of our Lobos and we'll keep you uh, posted uh, for an opening firm date. And just a reminder to continually check the coronavirus website and their limited operations articles to keep informed of how departments and services are, are operating. Until next week, this is Chael.